everybody welcome back here's another awesome RC drone the 110 GT DSM 2 comes in a clear package here obviously easy to see oh, we're missing that one um, not too much on the outside but we'll open it up and check it out so here is the drone itself fits right in your hand very cool looking those little tiny outrunners here you can see the sizes on them King Kong, your antenna. This has the DSM-2 receiver on it already. So there's that. Here's a spare body in white. Instruction manual. In here we have some other goodies. That's everything in there. Here we have a battery. 350 LiPo 2S. Here we have a mini USB cable so you can plug it in and adjust the flight controller. Here we have some props and bolts. Couple different colors for you there. Here we've got a board or a plug in, so if you want to add another receiver or external receiver of some sort, you can do that. Here's a prop tool. I'm not sure what this is, but I, I'm pretty sure it's probably something for the battery hold on. And the manual. A lot of information on this one here. I'll just kind of give you a quick little scan, scan through. Here's the US side. It says here ESCs should support multi shot, one shot, and DS, D shot. Two millimeter carbon frame. Frequency table there for the different cha uh, channels. Here's where you'll plug it in, how you'll plug it in and do it. What the switches do. A little info on firmware and service. So yeah, there you go. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. We'll get this, you know, ready to go. And we'll go out and take a rip. Okay guys, here you go. Got it bound up, got everything working. Um, props on it. You can see it comes with white and these are the props you saw earlier in the video. I put all these ones on, there's right and lefts. Um, the receiver, this is the Spectrum one. You see this little tiny gold thing here? That's a button. So in order to make it bind, you have to hold that little gold button down. You'll feel it kind of clicks and plug in the battery and then the receiver will go into bind mode. So that's how I figured it out. And then in clean flight, I had to adjust it for the um, DSM-X versus DSM-2. So you could do either on this one. Factory was set up for DSM-2. I had to change it to the 2048 or whatever it is to talk to the DSM-X. So without further ado, we'll get a battery on it and go for our maiden flight. All right, here we go, I've got the battery on it. There's a little rubber band on the bottom here. You just uh, put it underneath there and away you go. So that's all that's to that. So here we go. Here we go, made in flight. Just all the stock pids and everything out of the book. Um, let me set my timer here real quick. Now timer. We'll start with probably about four minutes. See how that works. Here we go. So I've got mine set up here. We'll be in level mode. The middle one here will be uh, air mode. And then this will be my arm in the motors. So Whoa. here we go, first flight. Need a little throttle expo. Oh, it has a lot of power though. How about that? Very nice. Not quite enough throw to do some flips and rolls, but very nice. Very nice feel to it so far.
a little jumpy on that throttle. land it and make a couple adjustments. Really jumpy on that throttle. Okay, we made a couple adjustments. Let's give her another shot here. See what happens. Feels a little better. Still a little jumpy. This little guy's fast though. You see that thing? Rip. Hope you guys can see that. It flies awesome. I'm not gonna lie. There's a little bit of wind blowing it. You can see the thing is just locked in awesome. Very nice. Now here is what I like to call man mode, but wow, look at that. Flips right out of the box. I cranked my throws up to about 125. That's very nice. I'll probably crank them up a little more, but hey, that's doing the trick. Nice. That was air mode. This thing is just rocking. Super cool flying bird. Wow. See it? We got Mount Baker in the background. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, so that's our timer. We're gonna land it and see what's going on here with that battery. See how it looks. Okay, so there you go, guys. We're down to 32%. That was after a four-minute flight on this battery. So I'd probably say you're good to go about four and a half minutes maybe <clears throat> per flight with the stock battery so there you go pretty awesome I just cannot get over how well that thing flies that flies amazing um, I'll show you what I did here in the radio I had to reverse the aileron and rudder and travel adjust here's my travel adjust to get the motors aileron elevator rudder um, I'll probably crank the aileron elevator up to 130, 140 rudder as well. Um, so there, that's what works for me.